You know, going between recording One Piece and Vinland Saga is such whiplash. Because One Piece, I just skip like six minutes into the episode every time to start. And then this one's like a fat, like 20, it was this one, 24 minutes, like a one minute intro. But ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus. And today we continue our Vinland Saga journey with Sword. Now, in the first episode, we were, in, we were introduced to Thor's and sort of his family. And I think this overarching goal, which is to get to Vinland, this just amazing place where it's just fruitful there's like more than just one season and just ice like where they are now and like i said yeah i think that's like sort of the goal over the course of the series i'm guessing at least that's what it's setting it up to be that being said we're gonna hop into this if you're new to the channel make sure you drop a sub it's not too late to jump on and let's get started I don't know why that reminded... Oh, Northern England... That reminded me of the Spongebob movie with a giant boot in the water. <laughs> no. No! While they're bathing? The English are shameless. Oh my gosh! King's orders. This king is evil. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm like, I see any place that looks relatively nice. I'm like, okay, they either live in tyranny or they're living illegally. Oh, and we're, and we're back. Oh my gosh. This is almost like too meta. See, like those kids like play dead after seeing like people actually dead. <laughs> you're like, what if you're not a warrior? Do you live in the afterlife separately? <laughs> Leif Erikson's set off to Norway. He wants to see more of the world. <gasps> Thorfinn. Oh no. Dude, look at all the scars on Thor's. I like how you said, can you pass on a message? Like it was like a casual thing. Yeah, there's a warship coming. Another. Oh, so this has happened before. Okay, maybe I shouldn't be as worried. Damn, that's pretty. They're all just Vikings or coming to recruit, maybe? Thor's the troll. Yeah, they're actually trained soldiers. <laughs> You ask that so casually. Yom's Vikings. God, he sounds so cool. Oh. Oh, they're respecting him. Floki. Wait, was that the guy from the first episode at the beginning? No, 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 it wasn't. No, the first guy was named like Thor Storsky or something. They're all listening! Yom's Vikings. Guessing that maybe that's who he was fighting with in the, the be very, very beginning? He's reporting about that. Oh, shoot. So relative to the king. I see. Oh, shoot, invading England. He doesn't want any part of it. Wait, what's going on? Oh, he deserted? Ooh. Captain of the Yom's Viking. I mean, is he going to fight him to make him? I... Doing what? Gathering people? Uh, a chance to redeem himself in their leader's eyes. Yes, yeah, more like intimidation. I think he changed. And he formed this life here and wanted, wanted it a certain way. That's why he deserted. Ooh. Oof. They're actually excited. Oh gosh. They don't know like the horrors of war. I think if Thoris goes, he's going alone. He doesn't want to rope anybody in the village into it. Dude. Like those are different beasts. He's gonna do it to take the place of anybody else. So the Yams Vikings are a big deal. They dodge taxes. That's how strong they are. I like that as like a measurement. <laughs> oh, they're leaving. I think he said yes. Oh, so he's not like forcefully recruiting. So Thor is definitely said yes, but he's just asking if there's anybody else that wants to partake. They'll take anybody they can. So they're sitting one battleship. 
Dude, I feel like this. Dude, Thor's. Oh, this is so sad, man. They're all celebrating, like being able to represent themselves. Especially the scene we saw when Thor's was in battle thinking only of Helga. He's like, they will know. They will understand. Gosh. One day. Mm. It's like a switch flipped inside him. Oh, he literally faked his death. Mm -hmm. And he'll do anything to avoid the village being hurt. We've seen that. Well, not really, but like the whole sheep thing. He cares about other people more than himself, far more. I wonder if he'll forbid anyone to come with him. Wait, does Thorfinn really think he's going, little guppy? Oh, shoot. The warship. What? Leif Erikson's joining. Safer than traveling alone. True, actually. Merchant going alone. Dude, it's, I love the helm so I, I don't know if you call it a helm, but I love that. Everyone loves war. It's like this fantasy for kids. But like I said, we've already seen like the depths that it, that it goes whenever that switch flipped. It's kind of dark, man. Oh, you were supposed to be dead. He's breaking the rules. I feel like Thorfinn's going to be very upset whenever he's told no, because I think he 1 million percent thinks he's going at this point in time. That's from your son. He broke that kid's arm? Oh my gosh. Got a little too competitive. He'll grow up to be a good fighter. I feel like Thor doesn't want to hear that. They're all like bruised. <laughs> Why did Thorfinn get so frustrated? Was it because his dad's leaving or just because he kept dying so fast in fake war? Dude, this guy is going to die the most tragic, bloody death. Ari, oh my gosh. He's so excited and gung-ho. It's going to be so sad. I think Thorfinn already wants to be that age where he doesn't have a wooden sword. <laughs> He's done playing with wooden toys. Oh, this is a worrying trend. There's the chest. I think it was like a, a blade or a knife or something. Oh, it was a helmet too. I'm guessing like a lot of Thor's old Viking stuff. It's a sick blade. Is that standard for like Vikings? Like these shorter knife type? It's like a it's like a short sword, but it's not a knife. You know what I mean? It is pretty though. Oh. So they're called swords, technically. <laughs> He's like, I don't know! Jeremy, down the street! No one has any enemies. Because he has to. Does Thor's truly believe that nobody has any enemies? Like, truly. Or any reason to hurt someone else? I'm thinking of, like, the extremities. Like, someone comes in and murders your whole family. Are you just supposed to sit there and take it, you know? Stray Moy. Fro Islands. Dude, th this anime is so pretty. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh. Okay, so they're visiting? Dude, this is messed up. Askelad. So Floki, right? An Askelad? What? Wait, why? You can do whatever you want with their ship and their cargo. I won't pay you in exchange for his body. Why would he want Thor's dead? Just be what? what just because he hesitated to say yes, or just because he is a deserter? Is this entire thing, like the entire recruiting of him for this war, just a setup to kill him? Like just because he's a deserter and there's like no redeeming that? I could see that. Oh my gosh. Floki Askeladd. Floki is paying Askeladd. Oh my gosh. And from what we've seen from his men, he's a, a, a seemingly unhinged person. It's not like he's going to be like, well, what did he do? He's going to be like, oh, gold, free stuff? Sure, man. Why not? Oh, dude, the plot thickens. Solid episode setting up even harder now. Kind of venturing away from this whole like, oh, we're going to Vinland. And now, oh, Thor's and his men have to kind of go off the war. That sucks. And a very, very strong scene with Thorfinn and then him saying you don't have any enemy I, like I said that's a tough you know sort of motto or I guess way to live 
is is saying like there's no one who it's okay to hurt it's like yeah of course you don't want to have to hurt anyone i love this deadpan like delivery though of thorfinn like father you're you're going to war tomorrow and then what did he say to helga at the end yeah take care of him for me well he's trying his best to leave behind this this uh i guess sort of like beacon of peace for thorfinn's i i, I can't imagine how much it just like pained thors to walk in and see thorfinn holding the knife or holding the, the sword like especially because of that one single impactful scene we had in the very first episode of him like having that switch flipped i'm glad we got to see that moment and now we can sort of compare it to the today but guys that has been it for my reaction to sword i hope you did enjoy make sure you leave a like on this one and i'll catch you next time peace peace